Hey guys, it's me, Brittany, and this is my channel, My Blue This Mark. video is um, question of the week number six, and this video has to do with um, two th different things. Uh, first, um, a lot of you guys asked me, did I do, or do I take any supplements or anything like that for my hair? And the second part um, has to do with my shopping haul video. Um, I kind of showed you guys some outfits that I wore. I'll post the link if you guys haven't seen the video. And a lot of guys, a lot of you guys thought I was in really good shape. Made me blush. Um, so you wanted to know my workout workout routine. So I'm gonna share it with you. Um, so first and foremost, uh, my hair. This is a braid out. I actually have a video on how I achieve this particular braid out. Um, it's kind of long. It's like three videos. I recorded it before I knew how to edit. So sorry. <laughs> um, but I plan to condense it one day, just not anytime soon. Um, so sorry about that, but. It's there if you want to find it, or if you really want to know how I did it. Um, as far as my, so to get started, as far as my diet, or as far as um, like any supplements my, I take, I don't take any supplements whatsoever for my hair or to work out. Um, and that includes like hair vitamins, multivitamins, or like protein supplements. I don't take any of that. Um, I try to get my nutrients from the food I eat. Um, like I follow. Um, kind of an anti-inflammatory diet, um, which pretty much means, you know, there's inflammatory foods um, that cause inflammation and um, increase your insulin in your body. And then there's foods that help, you know, reduce the inflammation um, in your body. So uh, what I pretty much try to do is I just try to keep that balance. So at the end of the day, I want to eat more anti-inflammatory foods than um, inflammatory foods. And I actually do the same thing for a little bit. Funny enough, we're on like the same diet. Um, like he always eats blueberries. I always feed him like the squishy blueberries I don't want. <laughs> and uh, it's worked really well for him. I noticed um, you know, I feel good, but I definitely noticed a difference in his shedding when I started to do that. I would say his shedding decreased like 75%, like dramatically. So, um, that's what I try to do. I, I get my nutrients from my food and I, I don't take any supplements. Um, as far as my workout routine, uh, I just want to preface it by saying I've always been a small girl. I've never had any trouble with weight gain whatsoever or any weight issues. I think up until last year or up until this year, um, I was a solid 120 until or since I was like in sixth grade. Like, really. <laughs> I've been like the same size. I kind of developed different ways, but as far as like actual weight, it's been the same. Um, so I really don't do cardio or anything like that. Uh, I make, I mainly focus on doing like intense weight training and I've been very successful doing that in the past year. Um, like I said before, I weighed like a solid 120 for like, you know, 10, 15 years, whatever. And, uh, up until last year I started the weight training and I gained, um, a solid, um, 10 pounds of muscle, which is really hard to do. And, um, yeah, so I'm actually same size. I just toned up, and I'm more like solid now. So, yeah. So pretty much what I do as far as weight training goes, I really like to weight train. I'm kind of enthusiastic about it. So what I do is I break the body up into you know four different sections or four different days, and on you know that particular day, whatever body part I have, I go like really intense on it, and I just kind of like burn out my muscle until it can't take it anymore. And because I only work out about two or three times a week. Uh, what happens is, um, you know, I kind of burn out that muscle. And by the time I go, you know, that body part comes around again, it's fully healed, it's ready to go, and we're ready to burn it out again. And um, by doing that, I've, you know, had really good um, gains, <laughs> as they call it. I've had really, really good gains. And I'm very happy with that, especially since I don't take any additional protein. I just kind of let my body tell me what it's want, it wants. If I feel like I'm low in energy, I'll eat some carbs. Or, um, you know, if I just feel hungry, I'll just eat more. But I don't necessarily um, do anything extra as far as, you know, to get good gains. So, yeah. So, I will tell you guys a few reasons why I enjoy weight training. So, first reason um, is it really keeps your body looking young. Like not only does it give you like muscle tone, but what happens when you weight train is, I don't know if you guys ever seen anybody who is like pumping iron. Like you may want to check out some videos and see what I'm talking about. Like when they start like pumping or really getting their set in, 
blood goes to that area of the body. And what happens is that blood is just trying to help that muscle do what it can and trying to repair any damage that's caused by the weight training. So not only does the blood help the muscle, but it also helps the skin. So it helps the skin repair itself. It helps the skin stay renewed. And the skin in general is attached to that muscle. So it's going to stay really firm on that muscle, which means as you get older, your skin's not going to sag. You know, there's this link. I'm going to find it and post it in the description box. There is this lady I found on Dime Wars, and I swear she's 70. And she has probably a better body than everybody. I mean, really, it's 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 a great body. So I'll post it. You guys see what I'm talking about. But, you know, it really helps keep your skin firm so you don't get that sagging or that age skin. So first great thing about weight training. Second great thing uh, about weight training. Oh, sorry. I just turned off the lights. <laughs> Second great thing about weight training is that no one really does it or about being like in really good shape is nobody does it. I mean, most people don't. Uh, you know, most people work out just so they can not gain weight. So when you have like a really extra firm body, it's very noticeable uh, and people pay attention. I've had people like walk up to me and say, you have a great back. I'm like, who? You know, I never even thought about my back, you know, but since I start working out, I get compliments like that or people like, wow, you really good shape, you know? And um, when you're in really good shape, it just reflects and like, you know, your confidence is way, way up because, you know, you look wonderful. Your clothes fit wonderful. If you're in great shape, you know, you don't have to go be flashy with bells and whistles. You can have your regular stuff on and look fabulous. And, you know, a toned, nice body really shows through. So I love weight training for that reason, too. And the third reason, oh, I guess there's four reasons, actually. The third reason is because I just love to feel stronger. Like weight training, you really get more strength and it feels like awesome. Like sometimes I'm out or at work and people are like, oh gosh, this box is too heavy. And I'm like, I got that, you know. Now I can do things like maybe I wouldn't have been able to do before. Like instead of carrying like one thing of water, I can, or one like 32 pack of water or 24 pack of water, instead of like carrying one or barely being able to carry one, I could carry like two. And I'm like, good. And it feels great to be strong. And the fourth reason is because, well, I'll just describe it. Like sometimes I'm in the gym and I'm like getting it in, you know, my set or whatever, like, you know, whatever, doing my squats. And, you know, sometimes when you're in the gym, it can be busy. So people want to work in with you and that's great. You know, it's all good. And I just love it when there's a guy who wants to work in with me and I do more than he does. <laughs> I don't know why it feels so empowering to me. I just love it. Like, um, my strongest body part is my legs and I can do 50 pounds on each side. I could probably do more. I haven't done like squats in a long time. I've been doing like other exercises, but not specifically squats. And so I could probably do more now, but, um, I can do like 50 on each side and that's impressive y'all. Like, you're not, when you go to the gym, you're typically not going to see somebody doing it. So I'm, I'm pretty proud of that. And I just love it when I'm getting my squats in, you know, I got my little fifties on each side, you know, and I look over and the guy next to me is doing like 25, 35. <laughs> I just really get a kick out of that. And so I guess that kind of goes in the third reason of just like, like being strong. And sometimes I just like being stronger than other people. <laughs> So I love weight training. It's great for you. It makes you look good. It makes you feel good. And people notice. So that's it. That is my whole video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it answered some questions for you. If you want to know like specifically what I do, just send me your email and I'll send you the link. Um, it does change because, you know, you can't do the same workout all the time because your body will get used to it. But I'll definitely send you what I have been doing lately. So anyway, in exchange for this information, I hope that you wait to subscribe because I hope you enjoyed that vi this video. And I hope to see you soon. Happy growing and have a good night.